and welcome to this video about Confluence and Jira. Now, this video is going to cover how you can create a Jira ticket directly from Confluence, which is actually a pretty cool use case, uh, especially when you're reading documentation that you think has to be updated or uh, reviewing something like a product document and you want to add a ticket for like your software team. We'll start off in Confluence, and this does require having Confluence and Jira. So I've got this connected in my cloud, and I'm just going to open up a page, maybe on my ticket triage process. And as I review it, I might realize maybe these steps are incorrect, or maybe more information could be added here. And I want to flag this for another team to work on. What I'll do is select the text that I want to flag, and I can either comment or create an issue. This little menu pops up automatically, so I'll just click Create Issue, and it will let me select from projects that are connected that I have visibility to. So I'm going to drop this into my sample space. I can then pick the issue type, and you'll notice that the summary is the selected text. I can add my description here, and then click Create. The page will refresh, and you'll notice visually on the page it now lists this ticket, IT Sample 14, and the status. I can quickly click to see this ticket, and again, the highlighted text is the summary, and the description I added is added to it. This is a great way to flag parts of your knowledge base that need to be updated. It does require having Jira and permissions in Jira to create tickets, but it's a really easy way to get your team helping you improve things. Just have them select stuff and go create that issue. Thanks for taking time to learn about this integration between Jira and Confluence, and I'm looking forward to seeing you in another video soon. <laughs>